is the only thing I know When it's black rain, then you know it's gon' pour huh? Running up the score is the only thing I know huh? If I need a comeback, I'm clutching a four And I'm getting sticky with the stick work too Ay, It's already over if I kick first Ooh, huh? Top 100, they can get work too Ay, First in the world, and it's got me in a mood Heavy, no, not heavy. Chevy six speed. Hmm. Interesting. I have a Ford six speed. So, what you trying to do, Cole? You feel me? What you trying to do? Bet you my Ford six speed faster than your Chevy six speed. Eh. Depends. He probably got a uh, Camaro. Um. Just depends on what Camaro he got, you know. I'm a, I like cars. If he got that, 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 you feel me? That, that the, I think it's a Z01. He got that Z01, but we might be in trouble. If he got that Z01, I think this is cover two. He just scooted that right safety over. Let's see. Are you gonna scoot the left safety? Are you gonna scoot the other safety over? That's the question. And he's not. So we're gonna throw the outside. Wow. Alright, so maybe it is cover two, figured. Maybe that safety has deep KO or some shit. I think that's what it'd be. Um Deep out zone KO. Would you imagine? <laughs> Would you imagine? And he got his corners in like 25 yard clouds. So the flats, so, so the flats essentially are gonna be open. So your flats are your are essentially gonna be open, and that's what I gotta take advantage of. You know, I gotta make him, I gotta make him change his zone drops. He's he, he's obviously comfortable in the defense he's in. So now I gotta make him change his zone drops. So now he's probably gonna keep his clouds where they are, but now put his put purples over there at five or some shit. Nope. Cool. You know, we just trying to work our way down the field. Okay, we got him to change his defense up a little bit. What is this? Oh, it's crazy because my crosser is wide open. Um. He just put that guy in the flat right there in the slot in front of triangle. Knew it. Took advantage of it. You feel me? You feel me? Took advantage of it. Okay, here we go again. We're going to try to get the crosser if he comes down and plays a drag. Oh, he manned him up. <laughs> we got playmaker, my boy. I know my guys are tired because they, they are running slow right now. Let me take a look at my boys. Woo! My boys is tired. But yeah, man. That's where a quarterback playmaker comes into play right there. De uh, Devontae's still tired, so we're going to throw a little O'Hell in the game. That boy O'Hell just signed with them, with them Ravens. Okay, let's see. Use a rush. Figured that was coming. <sighs> I figured that was coming. I figured the user rush was coming. Um, switch sides real quick. I'm on this right hash, so we should be able to throw this outside go route, bro. It's just, it really just depends. It really just depends. And the only thing it depends on is if that safety can get out there or not. Now, usually, we're already on the far left hatch. So, as far to the left as we can go. He usually can't get out there. But, like I said, with the deep out zone KO and shit like that. Man, you just never know. 
Good defense. Great defense. Great defense. Deep out zone KO. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, I see he didn't he didn't scoot that safety over at all to start the play. So I'm like, okay. Do you, my boy. Keep him right there. We're gonna pick on him. And I waited long enough to see if he actually would go over there. So here we go. Gun trips tight end flex with two tight ends in the game. It's most likely gonna motion down and run the ball. I just don't see why you would. Okay. Okay, all right. I don't see why you would pass the ball with two tight ends in the game, but on here, tight ends be having better route running than um, tight ends be having better route running than the witch callers, than the receivers. So it looks like we have ourselves a just a zone cutback demon. Just zone and go from there. We got a hard flat on his left side for the tight end drag. Yeah, just a cutback demon. All right, I, I, I've, I've seen enough already to understand. But, hey, I should have knew that. Chevy six speed. Of course he's going to run the ball. <laughs> <clears throat> and I have film study so I can see that he's running the ball. You know, so I can start run committing. But then I have I have been playing over top coverage. I've been playing over top coverage. You know what I'm saying? To to stop the, the pass, but it doesn't seem like you're gonna pass the ball. Dude's name is Chevy Six Speed. Dude's name is Chevy Six Speed. <laughs> why would he not be a runner? You feel me? Like why would he not? Why would he not be a runner? Oh, no, no, no. All right, we can deal with that. Come on. Thank you. Boy, name is Chevy Six Speed. <laughs> uh, come on, bro. So, you, we, 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 we know it's coming. And it's crazy because we really can't stop this shit. Drew Brees in the game? I wonder why Drew Brees in the game. Run commit. Nice, nice, nice. It's called timeout. Let you think about your actions right here, buddy. Let you think about it. Let you think about exactly what you want. This dude ain't, ain't passed the ball at all, bro. Like, Head over to your App Store or Google Play and download the best way to play fantasy, prize picks. Use code RAIN4 to get a 100% discount code up to $100. It's pretty simple. Pick two or more players from the board, choose over or under their projected stat line for the day, and choose which way you want to profit. With Flex Play, you can miss one and still win, or you can go big with the power play to win more. Prize Picks offers every sport you can think of from NBA to NFL to even college sports as well. Prize Picks has a ton of stats to choose from, including three pointers made, rebounds, assists, even the touchdowns, RBIs, and home runs. Prize Picks also allows mixed sports entries. Like you can take the over on LeBron's points and the under on Mahomes' touchdowns on the same entry. There's also many celebrities who use and partner with Prize Picks, including Famous Los, Matt Ryan, John Collins, and many more. In 2021, Prize Picks had 300,000 new members and paid out over $130 million in prizes. With the easy withdrawal system, Prize Picks is the best legal way to play player props. Once again, go to your App Store or Google Play and download Prize Picks. And don't forget to use code RAIN4 for a 100% deposit match up to $100. No. <sighs> what I'm mad, and as soon as I said that he passed away, what I'm mad about is because I'm trying to get out there. I'm trying with my user. I'm trying. I'm bumped. I got bumped. I'm trying, man. I am trying. So here's um no, this is not what I want. Alright, I tried to run commit late. That's a nice gap shoot. I tried to run commit late. So what so who I should have film study on is a safety or a linebacker that's in the box. So soon as he go to that play. I can see it right here without having to bring my screen back. 
I got a corner with film study, so my corner sees it. So what I should do is, I mean, what I could do is put him in a slot to bring him actually in the screen or put him at safety. But it kind of hurts. Um, it kind of hurts having him at corner because I got to bring my screen back to see it. I see you. I see you trying to do some adjusties over there, my boy. I see you. Trust me. I see you. I see you trying to get the adjusties in. I see you. When I see you. Now you went man to man. When I see you, uh, 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 uh. when I see you, when I, when I, when I, you feel me? I don't know nothing about that. It's just a scary because I don't know what that right corner is in, but it looked like he in some bullshit baseline. Oh, you know we're going to make the right read, sir. We're just patient with it. We just got to be a little patient with it. Mm. What a catch by you, Darren Waller. Big body. Come on, hike it. Hike. Ooh. Okay, okay. We trying to hurry up. Come on. Hike it, hike it, hike it. <sighs> That's that that's that six speed boy. You got that, that Chevy. That's that slow shit. You need that Ford. You need that Mustang. You need that Mustang. You got that slow shit, my boy. You got that slow shit. Now we go. Now we go. You feel me? Now we go smart route it so he ain't running too far back and bumping into a dude over there. You feel me? We'll smart route it now. But you got that slow ass Chevy six feet. So this right here is a position where I went usually win game versus runners. Right here. This is it. With 102 left, you're in a passing situation. You gotta try to move the ball down the field fast. You know, so you start to pass the ball. Now it's like, okay, do you actually have passing skills? Because if you don't, this is your weakness. Gun tight. You know what I'm saying? If you don't got passing skills, you're in trouble. We're actually going to blitz this right here when I really don't need to. But we're going to blitz this right here. You feel me? Now we got to see. Do you actually have passing skills? Now we're not going to blitz this. <clears throat> Whoa. I don't know. First of all, I don't know how we picked it off. Second of all, I don't know what route that was to where he just... Third of all, who the fuck is the offensive lineman? But I don't know what route that was. Like I just told y'all, bro. Like I don't know if I'm a psychic or what. But I tell y'all, these are the opportunities when I usually win these games versus runners. Right here. You gotta get them in a passing situation and they fuck up passing. And now it's like, well, can't beat this guy. Why? Why you can't beat him that well? I can't beat him because I my my game is to run the ball all all, all game. But if I'm down two possessions or I'm down a possession, I can't play because I can't pass the ball. Guys got to get better, man. That's why I've been trying to tell people, like, it's better to be a passer if you don't know how to pass the ball. Learn how to pass the ball. Don't just say, I'm going to just run the ball just because Madden's bad and Madden's going to allow you to run. Because what about next Madden? What if they, what if they, what if they totally take the run game out of the game? Now you are forced to pass. But if you learn how to pass last Madden or the previous Madden, you know how to pass now. So it's like, that's all I'll be trying to explain to people. All, all you have to do is just learn how to pass. Now, excuse me, once you've learned how to pass, you know how to pass for the rest of the Maddens. I learned, that was the first thing I learned how to do, pass the ball. When I first started playing, I got in five wide. Five wide and start passing. Passing. Fuck it. Pass the ball, sling the ball. Cause running ain't just running not it. 
I think I'm finna get a disconnection loss. It's just taking too long to load in. I hope I don't. I hope I don't. Um, don't look like I am. Lovely. But yeah, man, that's where that's why I usually win a lot of my games versus runners. Right there before half. Either, you know, and if he would have scored right there, we wasn't in bad shape at all. You know what I'm saying? Because we still, you know what I'm saying, it would have been, if he got the two points, it would have been 14-14. And he get the ball at halftime. And now, you know, I got to play like I've been playing, trying to stop that run he's doing. And I wouldn't, I ain't really, I didn't really struggle at all offensively. So, I mean, if he would have scored right there before half, it would have been, it just would have been a good game. And I'm, you know, I'm prepared for that. It's, I've been having crazy games. But that's what people got to get better at, bro. You, you got to get better right there. All right. This was man to man. I don't know what he just now went to, but. Throw the low ball right there. I ain't going to mess with your user right now. I ain't going to mess with your user right now. So he went to a cover three, which is a lot of people are playing lately. I ain't gonna mess with your user, my boy. Let's see. Are you gonna base your line? You are gonna base your line. Nice. Perfect. I wanted to just wait just long enough to where that defender couldn't animate and pick that shit up. I ain't wanna lob it. Uh uh. I wanted to make sure he got way outside of him. Got it. This is man to man. We want the skinny post. He's probably trying to use. He's probably trying to use this new with his user. We want the skinny post. Knew the user was coming. We want the skinny post. Doing. People be like just so simple. You feel? <laughs> I can call out a man. I can call out a man's whole game plan. I can call out a dude's whole game plan. I didn't think playmaker would work right there. I playmaker try and go back down the field towards me, and I didn't think it would work like that, but it did. It knew exactly who I wanted to playmaker and how I wanted to do it. Um, I feel like this is a user blitz situation again. Oh, I thought we had. Oh, my God. So I seen that corner lit up um, before the game started. I seen him lit up, but I didn't know he was doing it like that. Three man right out there. I'm mad they made me come back down the field when I caught that. I'm mad they made me come back down the field. Okay, zone. Zone. Okay, he's going. He actually went baseline man to man. You don't usually you don't usually see that. That was that was different. He went baseline man to man. That was different. That was different. Hmm. That was different. Baseline man to man is weird because of a couple situations. So when you play a man to man, you honestly want to be like in front of your man. You want to be man to man in front of your man. But it'll catch some people off. And, and, and let's say uh, baseline man to man is kind of good and bad. It's it's pretty even in mutt because your player's ninety nine speed, your defender's ninety nine speed, so your defender can make up on time. Whereas in in, in rigs, let's say I got a ninety four speed receiver. You have a 91 speed corner playing man to man. You baseline, your guy's already out of position. Your guy's already out of position, and your guy's slow as hell. So when you baseline playing man to man in rigs, you already putting yourself out of position. But what's good about baseline man to man is it's you. It looks like it looks like zone, and it throws off my pre read. Uh, my pre-read combinations. So as y'all seen, I didn't even uh, I put zone I put zone combinations out there. But then whenever I realized what it was and I hiked it, I'm like, okay, this is man to man. Why? Why? When I why? 
I just clicked my bro. I just clicked my analog stick in for that guy to go and attack the quarterback. My man who was guarding somebody way down the field came up to attack the quarterback. That is crazy. Third and twenty, you just ran stretch. That is just unfucking believable. Third and twenty, you ran stretch. That is unbelievable. Third and twenty, you ran stretch. Okay, so here's a crazy situation. I see the formation: gun, trade, wide flex. I might get, but all right. I'm gonna get beat by a backside dig. Or I'm gonna get beat by a post. And if it's a post, then I just gotta, I just gotta get beat. If he motion him over, I'm blitzing. But if I get beat on a post, then I just, okay, yeah, we're gonna blitz this. My blitz didn't go in right, but cool. You made a bad read. Nice stick. I think my blitz didn't go in right because I don't even have my audible set on defense. I don't even think I got my audible set. Um, hmm. it's just man to man. Now I don't know what it is. Let's just try something. Still man to man. Nice low ball. Patience in that pocket. Patience. Straight up man to man. Close in that. Close in that heat. Sent six. I blocked six. And we was chilling. Oh, you thought there's two of them out there, my boy. There's two of them out there. There's two in routes out there, my boy. My son is shun shun. Two of them, good. Single back wing tight. Well, shit. They get in that. They get in that defense, then, good. They gotta get in that run defense, then. Let's get a net run defense then. If he passing the ball, we might be in trouble. Man, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. How Slade just got a sack right there, I don't know. <laughs> My right corner, Slade, got a sack. I don't know. This dude is, this dude is so backwards. He has that. He has that. Whoa, whoa, just make the tackle. Perfect. That's fine. This dude passed the ball on first and ten. Okay, this is probably another pass, so. We're good. Out route with that. With the you do that? Let me get that up off you. Oh my god. He passed the ball on first and ten and runs the ball on third and twenty. Um I don't know if this is a run or a pass. Post Slate, talk to me. <clears throat> uh, not mad about it. Not mad about it. The reason he scored, so I, I didn't play over top coverage right there, even on the play when um, short, fucking short, even on the play when Odell got beat over top, uh, I didn't play over top coverage so. Tell you guys a little bit about how my defense actually works and why y'all always see me getting ran on. Right? So I play over top coverage every single play. And it's so that we do not get beat on go routes like that. I hate getting beat on, on one play touchdown beaters, bombs and shit like that. I hate it. You know, so um I play over top coverage so that my guys do not get beat deep. Well, when you play over top coverage, that essentially takes your DBs and your safeties out of the run fits and out of the, out of the run game. So that's why you guys, majority of the time, see me getting ran on. And it's like, damn, Randy got no run defense. And it's like, I don't because I'm trying to. I'm playing ultimate pass defense. I tried to come down and click on that, and just to make sure that he didn't jump in front of me to catch that. But y'all be like, yo, Rainey got no no run defense. And recently I've been having good run defense and it's because I haven't been playing over top coverage. Now the reason I have not been playing over top coverage is because everybody's 99 now. I got deep route KOs on my guys, things like that. So I ain't really too worried about it. You feel me? 
Um, but every now and then, you guys will see me get beat on deep passes. And it's like, wait a minute. Rain don't usually give up those deep passes. And it's because now I'm not playing over top coverage. So if I would have played over top coverage right there with Slay, Slay would have been on that. This is cover two. Hike it, hike it, hike it. Ah, I didn't. That was about to be picked the fuck off. <sighs> it was cover two, but I wanted the outside go route, but I ran the I ran the straight vertical right there, so we got jammed inside. Take a look at it. Look at Devontae's first two steps. It's just straight. Now, if you take a look at it, we run the outside fade go route. We're going to block him to make sure we got everybody blocked up because we're going to throw this outside go route. Go outside the corner, sideline, voila, magic. I'm getting tired of teaching you all that shit. Now, go back. Go back to the play before. Go back to the play before. Go back to the play before, and I drained a regular streak, and we got jammed inside. We got jammed inside, which essentially jammed me to the safety. Nice lob. Get your feet down. We did not. Motherfucker. But the play before, we got pushed inside because I ran a straight vertical, so we got pushed inside to the safety. So if I run the outside go route, we'll actually get jammed, but we'll go outside the corner, which gives that safety. He ain't got enough time to get over there like that, as you guys can see. So just details, man. <clears throat> details. Details, details, details. All right, so right here is a passing situation. We're playing over top coverage. If we get ran on, we get ran on. But we should not get beat on the pass. And if we do, I'll be there to help out a little bit. But I see what he's running now. I see why we, uh, I, not him, the last dude ran something like that. And um, when I picked it off and I'm sitting there wondering how, what route he ran, it's like an out and up. Well, it's, it's like a, a drag and up. And if I'm not playing over top coverage, we're going to get beat on that. So right here, he wants to slant with the cross over the post. We've got a deep third for the post. And we're good. And we're mother... I'm good. I'm good. Y'all don't know that. That's old school. That's old school. Mother... I'm good. Ooh, we finna... We finna... Let me get close enough right here. Bam. Now you know what time it is. Now you know it. Devontae, show me you can cook that dude, bro. Devontae, show me, show me you, show me you, show me you, you feel me? Show me you, you, you deep fryer elite. Devontae, show me you, show me you deep fryer elite over there. They need a new, they need a new one. Deep fried elite. Deep fried that boy. Show me, hey. <laughs> hey. Hey, 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 hey. Quick video today, man. You know what I'm saying? Taught y'all a couple things, man. Slight shit, man. Take a piece of everything that I'm teaching y'all and incorporate it into y'all's game. And I promise y'all it'll be better. Trust me, y'all will be better. Um, I'm 5 0. Um, 5 0. Take a look at the leaderboard real quick just to see what's going on. Anybody doing anything crazy so far? Nothing crazy so far. <coughs> Excuse me. He can win 23. Um,. 21, 23, 23. Yeah, ain't nobody doing nothing crazy so far. 24, he gonna win 24. Mm, 20, yeah, niggas ain't really doing nothing too crazy. He gonna win 24. I lost to this dude before. I beat this guy before and I lost to this guy before. Look like he can win 24, so he, you feel me? Guys ain't looking like no 25. Guys, they look like no 25s out there. 24. He okay. My bunch, my bunch went 25 and 0 last weekend, so it looks like he might do it again. I'm trying to match up with him, honestly, because you know what I'm saying. I'm pissed off because they got they got that man in front of me just because his strength of schedule. You know what I'm saying? But hey, ain't no beef. Hey, hey, ain't no beef, bro. Hey, Blair Wayne. Oh, yeah.